As expected, the presidential nominees used the numbers in their campaign speeches today. President Obama made two stops in the state of Ohio. Mitt Romney was also there, but first, he was in Wisconsin, in the Milwaukee area. Fox 11's Laura Smith joins us now with more on the visit to West Allis. Well, Michelle, former Packers great Bart Starr and Governor Scott Walker joined Mitt Romney on the campaign trail today. Then the energized crowd heard from the Republican presidential nominee himself. He took the stage to discuss the economy and jobs. Like his rival, Mitt Romney is on a hectic pace of campaigning. In West Dallas, he delivered what his campaign is describing as his closing argument. If you believe we can do better, if you believe America should be on a better course, if you're tired of being tired, then I ask you to vote for real change. Paul Ryan and I will bring real change to America from day one. Romney attacked President Obama, saying his efforts in office have fallen short. He promised to be a post-partisan president, <laughs> but he became the most partisan, blaming, attacking, dividing. He said he was going to focus on creating jobs, and said he focused on Obamacare, which killed jobs. He said he was going to cut the federal deficit in half, and then he doubled it. The Republican presidential nominee also zeroed in on the latest jobs report, saying the numbers are further proof that the president's policies aren't working. He said he was going to lower the unemployment rate down to 5.2 percent right now. Today we learned that it's actually 7.9 percent, and that's 9 million jobs short of what he promised. Unemployment is higher today than when Barack Obama took office. Romney warned supporters that re-electing his Democratic opponent would threaten another government shutdown and national default. The former Massachusetts governor pledged to work with Congress to avoid that outcome. He's ignored them. He's attacked them. He's blamed them. The debt ceiling will come up again, and shutdown and default will be threatened, chilling the economy. Romney told supporters he has promised change and has a record of achieving it. I know how to change the course that the country's on, how to get us to a balanced budget, how to build jobs and help raise take-home pay. Accomplishing real change is something I don't just talk about, it's something I've done. Fox 11 will air Romney's speech in its entirety tonight at 10, or you can watch it on fox11online.com. We also have President Obama's speech yesterday in Ashwaubenon on the website. Look for a link to both of them on the homepage.